all that aluminium work. I made the fairing and the tank and the rear panelling all to be repaired. Handle bars were smashed off, that's for some temporary tubes in there to get it out of the van. Well this looks like madness, and it is. Wheels were out of a line after my crash, out of alignment. By about six millimetres, quarter of an inch, out the front wheel. I've done a scaled, well, full scaled drawing and uh, arm and leverage to work out and that swinging arm, which I think has gone to the left at the back, twisting the wheel or pushing the wheel out of alignment with the front one. That swinging arm needs to move over the two arms by about one eighth of an inch, about three millimetres. We'll give a quarter of an inch at the front, two to two and a half metres away. So, I've got axle stands through the swinging arm. Roll bolted to the floor and to the planks of wood over the pit so the bike can't move. Supported with a steel tube and against the pivoting point of the swinging arm. Tie strap holding the front of the bike so it can't swing left. And also blocks of wood against the chassis also stopping it from going to the left whilst I pull this swinging arm to the right using these tie straps I've tried brute force I wasn't strong enough I could hold it but it sprung back I've tried it cold but it wouldn't budge so I've tried it with some warmth from an ordinary handheld blow lamp with a butane canister and not an acetylene welding torch that would be too hot and soften the metal too much so I've just warmed it slightly to make it easier to pull hopefully once I've done that one I'm going to pull the other one over so that the gap between the two is as it was before I started pulling on it which is just a fraction over 10 inches 10 and 1 30 second to be precise hope that's all clear as mud I've looked at the front but without a, a, an align, alignment jig uh, you can't really tell if the chassis is twisted but it certainly doesn't look as though it is and the indication having to turn the forks to the right to get the wheel alignments correct means that the back wheel is pointing to the right so it needs to swing back in line with the bike and the chassis and then turn the bar straight and it should be equal distance each side when measured the string around the back tyre to the front. I don't use straight edges of pieces of wood because you can't guarantee that they're straight. A piece of string under tension can only be straight. That's it for the moment, I'll let you know how it goes on. Madness. But sometimes a skill has to give way to madness. And uh, heavy handed work. Well, I'll move the right hand one over 
six millimeters to the right, just on the quarter inch. I've now got the other one under stress. I left the first one overnight. I've only used a ordinary handheld blow lamp, the butane cylinder, not a welding torch, it should be too hot. So hopefully it will uh, age harden. Depends on what metal, 6061T will age harden after it's been quenched. 7020 will harden itself at 30 days at room temperature. It's information I have, but you never know what material these are. So it's a shot in the dark, but whatever it is, it's bloody tough stuff. It took some shifting, so it's more than strong enough. I'll see whether it lines up or not when I get the wheels back in. Well, by using some uh, straps on the swing arm and some heat from a blow lamp, not the oxyacetylene that's too hot, and gentle bits at a time, sixteenth of an inch and an eighth of an inch and so on, I think we've got them uh, in line now, so I've got st string. Attach around the back wheel. And round the front wheel. A bit cramped for room here because of this jet vehicle. See the spacing is now. Correct. So within one thirty second of an inch. What I'm going to do is set the big drag race tyre out. I'll set the top speed wheel in, which is a narrower tyre, and check the alignment on that before I start turning my attention to straightening the fairings, tank, and tailpiece, etc. But I do want to check the forks, but I think they seem to be okay.